Competitor number three, Lynn Go, is a PhD student in industrial and systems engineering whose presentation is titled, Improving Social Ecological System Through Dam Network Planning. Thank you. We have more than 16 million dams in this world. Dams are built to control flow of water to achieve a variety of goals, suppressing floods and drought, conserving wildlife, providing water for activities such as human consumption, irrigation, and so on. But do those dams work as well as we expected? The answer is no. In the 21st century, floods accounted for 44% of death caused by natural hazards, more than any other natural hazard. Whereas drought caused a 20 billion US dollar loss per year in the United States alone. 20 billion US dollars can feed more than 3 million people three meals a day for a whole year. And since 1989, the number of extinct freshwater fish in the North America has increased by 25%. We should and can do better. So what is wrong? We have multiple user groups in a dam network. Residents, farmers, fish, and so on. The problem is that there are always discrepancies between water supply and water demand for each user group. And those discrepancies cause the floods, the drought, and the extinction of some species. What causes the discrepancies? The fluctuation in user demands and variation in precipitation do. They are uncertainties in this system. We have a dilemma here. We must manage these uncertainties, but we cannot predict them accurately all the time. Therefore, to improve our dams, we must make water flow plans robust to those uncertainties, which means the fluctuation and variation should not significantly increase the discrepancies which cause the system failures. How can we do this? In my dissertation, I am exploring the solution space of water flow plans. By developing design scenarios considering different uncertainties, I pinpoint the segments in the dam network that are sensitive to those uncertainties, and I analyze how sensitive they are so that we can improve them accordingly. By giving design scenarios satisfying solutions by giving satisfying solutions of water flow plans, we can improve our dam network to be robust and improve our social ecological system to be sustainable because we make sure that discrepancies be less severe and less frequent. Therefore, as a result, billions of people, plants, and wildlife will no longer be suffering from floods and drought. The key point is satisfying solutions are not optimal, but they are acceptable, and they are relatively robust. Thank you. <laughs>